Yes, I see your point, dear Bentley. Richard. But I don't think that I am impressed with the Whig Prime Minister, John Russell. Although I have to confess I have never voted. Never? I have my reasons, unfortunately. But deep down I feel I am conservative and of course a loyal subject of Queen Victoria. I would admit to 45. I believe I have nice hair and know that I am pale very pale. But I hope that I'm elegant. Very elegant. Usually, working all through the night, I sleep through the day. For me, that is the most comfortable way of working. Leaving the daytime to my beloved niece, Caroline. Caroline is the daughter of my sister, Elizabeth, and is everything a privileged 19th century young woman should be. Pretty, bright, confident, and openly intelligent. I am truly grateful to the Royal Academy for its recognition of my work, and feel privileged to join the ranks of so many great artists. This is a life's, a, a long, long life's ambition. I made my way towards St Gregory's Gothic doors, my energy diminishing with every step. My only goal was to see my work, the light of the Christ child finally in place. My painting was commissioned to rest behind a large marble altar with its gold embossed and heavily embroidered cloth. As I reached the door, the sound of triumphant organ music filled the church. The congregation turned to me and my companions in welcome. Oh, how they smiled and gestured to me with admiration. 